The 2022 Australian Open final between Rafael Nadal and Daniil Medvedev was arguably one of the most thrilling matches in the history of the sport. It was special on many levels as Nadal made history by becoming the first man to win 21 slams. The manner in which he came back from the brink of a crushing defeat was the cherry on top. Many have lauded the Spaniard for his comeback in the slam down under and joining the praises former world number two Alex Karecha. He opined that Nadal's comeback win could well be the turning point in tennis history. Medvedev easily took the first set as Nadal looked mentally defeated with worrying body language. Although the Russian had to work hard to win the second set, it was now just a matter of time before he lifted his first Australian Open trophy. In the sixth game of the third set, Nadal found himself staring at three break points. It was at this moment that the Spaniard stepped up his game. Not only did he win the game from 0 to 40, but he also went on to take the set and clay his way back into the match. After winning the third set, Nadal continued to grind against possibly the best hard-court player in the world at the moment. The Spaniard stole the fourth set and forced the match into a decider. Serving for the championship at 5-4, Nadal dropped serve. Memories of the 2012 and 2017 Australian Open finals, where he lost to Novak Djokovic and Roger Federer after leading in the fifth set, must have flashed before his eyes. However, Nadal immediately got the break back and closed out the match, winning the Australian Open for the second time in his career. Nadal beat Medvedev 2-6, 6-7-5. 6-4, 6-4, 7-5. For the first time in his career, Rafael Nadal is in contention for the calendar slam. Before the Australian Open, the big three were tied with 20 majors each after Djokovic won three out of the four slams in 2021. The Serb would have been the first to 21 had it not been for Medvedev, who beat Djokovic in the 2021 US Open final. To everyone's surprise, Rafael Nadal didn't just take the lead in the slam race by winning down under, but he also extended it to two slams by winning the 2022 French Open. For the first time in his career, the 22-time Grand Slam champion is in contention to complete a calendar slam. While Rafael Nadal has expressed his intention to compete at Wimbledon this year, his participation depends on the progress of his foot injury. If the world number 4 feels healthy, he will likely play at SW19 this year.